So welcome back to day 14 of Social 30. These are two thoughts today that we've actually uh, touched on previously, but they're very valuable. And this is why we're revisiting them. And even uh, the document here says, you know, whether this is your first time through Social 30 or you've been through it multiple times, this exercise is one of the greatest things that you can do for your network. And so the first thought is that idea behind Facebook that you're not your relationships within your friend network are not all created equal. Facebook does not see them all as carrying the same amount of weight. And so you've got to reactivate some connections uh, through Facebook by going to your friend network, figuring out who is in there that you realize you have not seen content from in years and make a connection with them on Facebook by commenting on a post that they've made. Then you will probably have to go to their profile to see it because those posts are not being served up to you. Uh, so keep that in mind. I, I've put this uh, thought in the social 30 several times because this is uh, an incredibly valuable way to spend your time trying to grow your business on social. The other thought is Twitter notifications. Make sure that you're staying on top of these, especially if Soundboard is tweeting for you. Uh, you want to make sure that you are uh, leveraging those connections. So just check your notifications and uh, see, you know, who's talking to you, who's liking you, who's following you, and make sure you're doing something about it. Uh, if somebody's following you, you know, if somebody reacts to a tweet of yours, follow them back, you know, if it's appropriate. If it's not, then just let it, let it ride. Don't worry about it. Um, but if somebody likes what you have to say, then um, go figure out what they're interested in and ask them a question about something that they're interested in. You know, figure out who they are, what they care about, and try to make a connection point with them. And all of that can, you can, be, you can figure all that out through your notifications. Um, you just dig in a little bit. So let's just take her an example here. Chris. Chris Wallace liked our tweet about avoiding high sugar foods and picking protein bars or fruit. So let's go see. Chris is a Juice Plus person, but we still want to make a connection with Chris, all right? So we know that he's liked our post about avoiding sugar, and um, he's very enthused about uh, some Juice Plus products. And so let's just tweet at him. Let's start a conversation. Chris, got any advice on how to avoid sugary treats for the kids this uh, holiday weekend. I'm gonna date myself here, but it's about to be Easter. All right, so we have just made, uh, started a conversation with Chris that could turn into something uh, more if you are from the perspective of trying to establish connections and you know, ultimately uh, move some products. So stay on top of those notifications. Don't let them get by you. Have a great day.